My name is Sean Al Reyes and I'm Regional Sales Manager for Macrometer. Today we're going to talk about popular uses for the VCOM flow meter in industrial steam applications. V-cone can be found in a variety of industries and markets, uh, included but not limited to downstream, offshore, uh, midstream, and onshore oil and gas applications, uh, industrial applications such as district energy, power, universities, hospitals, data centers, metals and mining as well, uh, and some municipal applications like uh, water treatment, Uh, Vico flow meters are used in a variety of steam applications and they include steam distribution and process steam. Uh, end users find using a VCOM flow meter advantageous because it offers a superior accuracy, plus or minus half a percent, and liquids in the line, like in the case of wet gases, do not have much of an effect on the measurement. So we're able to measure a fluid like steam with a little bit of liquid in the line uh, with very little impact to accuracy. The turndown ends up being very beneficial for the end users as well because a VCOM flow meter can provide a 10 to 1 or more turndown. One important aspect of a very large turndown is stacking transmitters. When your turndown exceeds 10 to 1, it's recommended that you use more than one transmitter in order to accommodate for the very large range of measurement. Uh, the issue with transmitters is that once a turndown of 10 to 1 is exceeded, the low end of the range accuracy ends up shifting significantly. So to combat that, we recommend using two transmitters, one measuring the high end of the range and one for the low end of the range. In the case of steam applications, a turndown larger than 10 to 1 is almost always the case, especially when using steam to heat facilities. You're using a lot of steam in the winter and very little in the summer. So having one flow meter that can measure throughout all of the different uh, temperatures ends up being ideal for end users. Other advantages of the VCOM flow meter include having a low straight run requirement. So what does that mean for end users? Uh, when it comes to differential pressure meters, a lot of technologies require a long straight run. So it could be anywhere from 5 to 20 diameters of straight run upstream in order to maintain accuracy of the technology. The advantage of the VCOM flow meter is that it only requires up to three diameters of straight run, and that's at the worst case. In many cases, end users can get away with zero diameters or one diameter of straight run upstream and maintain that plus or minus half a percent accuracy. VCOM flow meters are able to measure accurately with that low straight run because of the shape of the cone that's welded inside of the pipe. When you have very turbulent flows in the line, the cone ends up taking that turbulent flow and flattening its flow profile into a more symmetrical one. Because of the shape of the cone flattening the flow profile of the, of the fluid, you end up getting a much better signal and end up having a more accurate reading from your transmitter. Steam is used in electricity generation, energy storage, sterilization, distribution, and processing, which includes drying, cleaning, layering, reaction engineering, and epoxy drying, amongst others. Because the VCOM flow meter is a custom engineered solution for specific applications, it ends up being very beneficial in the case of any steam applications. For example, if the taps were needed to be rotated, uh, that would be very easy for a VCOM flow meter to handle. In addition, you can weld an RTD port on the body of the VCOM flow meter so that you can compensate for changing temperature in the multivariable transmitter. In steam applications, changing temperature and pressure 
are critical to measure. And so having an RTD port in the body of the flow meter allows you to do that, whether you're using a flow computer or a multivariable transmitter. Vcom technology has been around since 1985. Over 85,000 Vcom flow meters have been built to date, and over 5,000 of those have been in service for over 20 years. Through testing, we found that Vcom flow meters will maintain their accuracy for a minimum of 25 years. Many steam applications are in plant settings. And when you're in a plant setting, there's a lot of heavy equipment that will cause a lot of signal noise in the line. Most flow metering technologies are impacted greatly by the signal noise and it causes their flow readings to be very erratic. In the case of a VCON flow meter, the cone almost acts as a noise dampener. So it's conditioning the flow and also kind of dampening that noise. You end up getting a much more stable signal coming out of the VCON flow meter so that you can always count on the reading you are getting in the transmitter. That's why the VCON flow meter ends up being an ideal technology to install in any kind of noisy environment or wherever you're retrofitting into an existing piping. For more information on the VCOM flow meter or industrial applications, please contact the factory or reach out at www.macrometer.com.